Irish Wolfhound The Irish Wolfhound is a very large dog originally used to drag men from their horses and off of chariots. Also an accomplished hunting dog, the breed almost became extinct after boars and wolves disappeared from Ireland. Captain George Graham introduced Great Danes and Deerhounds to the breed, he helped to restore the breed by doing so. At one time, the Great Hound of Ireland was highly sought by royalty. They were sometimes given as a gift and battles were even fought over the ownership of the dog. This large and impressive canine was recognized by the American Kennel Club in 1897. Before going into the video, you need to grab the free dog training secrets guide in which we have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart, and obedient dog without spending hundreds of dollars. So make sure to check the first link in our description to the free video series guide. Now let's get into today's video. Irish Wolfhound Health Major Concerns, Gastric Torsion Minor Concerns, Osteosarcoma, Cardiomyopathy, Hip Dysplasia, Osteochondritis Dissecans Occasional Tests, Hip, Heart, X-rays, Physical Examination Average size height, 30 to 32 inches weight, 100 to 120 pounds male, height, 28 to 30 inches weight, 95 to 105 pounds female. Irish Wolfhound Breed History History tells of a great hound of Ireland that was presented to Quintus Aurelius Symmachus by his brother, in total, seven of the dogs were given to Aurelius. Paintings, statues, and jewelry of old depict this dog, once described in literature of the 1500s as bigger of bone and limb than a colt. The Irish Wolfhound was a mainstay of many royal courts, and at one time, the law stated that only royalty could possess these lovable, giant dogs. These dignified canines were often given as royal gifts, Sweden, Denmark, and Spain all received gifts of Irish Wolfhounds by other royal families. These hard-working and courageous dogs were used for hunting, and not just the boar or wolf but also stag and elk. In feudal times, they were trained to pull men off horseback and out of chariots on the battlefield. The breed almost became extinct in the 18th century, however, Captain George Graham was able to find a few of the wolfhounds, crossbreed them with Scottish deerhounds, the Tibetan Borzy, a Pyrenean wolfhound, and a Great Dane. This produced the noble dog we know today. Irish Wolfhound Breed Appearance The Irish Wolfhound can reach 7 feet in height when standing on their hind legs, although having them produce this pose is highly discouraged. On all fours, they are the size of a small pony. Their big head is long, and so is the muzzle. This extra-large canine has small ears that lay back against the head. An excited wolfhound will prick them up. A striking dog with a coat that is shaggy and wiry, the hair on the head of this imposing dog is longer over the eyes and under the jaw. The coat usually feels rough to the touch. An Irish wolfhound may be gray, brindle, red, black, white, or fawn-colored, however, gray is the most common color. Irish Wolfhound Breed Maintenance An Irish wolfhound is definitely not an apartment dog. They require daily exercise. A fenced-in yard is necessary so that they can get adequate exercise. This breed is not prone to a lot of shedding, they are considered an average shedder. It is recommended that you regularly brush the coat, perhaps every week, and every six months, you or your groomer should pluck the coat in order to remove excess dead hair. The nails and teeth should not be neglected, a large dog should have their nails trimmed often as it is much easier to trim bit by bit. While one must be careful about feeding an Irish wolfhound puppy, Growth formula is never a good idea for this breed when very young, it is important to feed your Irish Wolfhound puppy a high-quality food. Stay away from high-protein formulas as well. Irish Wolfhound Temperament Although they are giant dogs, the Irish Wolfhound is not necessarily a good guard dog. They are very sweet, patient, kind, and highly intelligent. An Irish Wolfhound might be able to ward off any would-be mischief makers because of their size but they will not be aggressive towards strangers. They are very eager to please their owners and are incredibly loyal. For the first two years of their lives, they are quite clumsy. They often take at least two years to mature. Because of this, extra time should be taken with your puppy in order to build their confidence. It is also recommended that you leash train your strong and forward pup at a young age, teaching them, before they get too strong, to walk beside you and not pull the leash. Athletic yet gentle, they do best with a firm, consistent handler. They get along with other dogs well, and children too. An amicable canine, they are one of few that gets along with virtually any other animal. Irish Wolfhound Food Consumption, 4.5 cups per day. If you like the video then make sure to hit that like button. Also if you want more dog training, guides, information then make sure to subscribe to our channel. Let me know what you think of this video in the comments and thank you for watching.